Hi guys, welcome back to my clones play series for 7 days to die, Alpha 16 stable. As always, I'm joined by my clone, Sins Eternal. Hey everyone. So we did do a fair bit of looting overnight, and I got lucky and looted one of the corpses that happened to have a mining helmet. So my sister's off to go see about some clay and see the trader. I'm gonna stay here and continue work on the garden so we can get this up and running.
Care to come see what I did? Sure. Oh, very nice. I'm gonna craft up more cobblestone frames and such. Just crafting the cobblestone now. Uh, sis, you want to pick this up? Pick which up? Come here. Oh, nice. A lot of glass panes. And do you have two more spots? Um, no. I have no more spots at the moment. Alright. Not until well, I get some way, of this stuff out of my inventory, so. That way on. it gives you. Some windows, and basically the materials to put some windows in and whatnot. Um, I'll have to go dig up some uh, gravel patches, though, probably. Those aren't as pretty as I remember. No, they aren't as pretty as you remember. Now you can just look out the window and think of a spider being there every time. Yeah. Okay, so just because we're um, not going to use the middle quite so much. Fine. Um, I'm going to plant, for the most part, the mushrooms in the middle here. Yeah. 15 spores. I'm going to try to plant all of them, if we can. Actually, let's start with nine, just to be safe. That will accommodate the five potato seeds and five blueberry seeds I had on me. Good.
This allows us to fit 48 crops. Very nice. So that gives us almost a hundred between the two floors. Mm -hmm. I've taken advantage of planting a bunch of uh, chrysanthemum, golden rod, and cotton as well. Because upstairs we can plant uh, corn and more potatoes. Yep. Because potatoes don't cost any uh, glass jars or anything. Whereas, you know, corn on the cob or... Uh, Cornbread does. Mm -hmm. Not, you know, at least until we can get out and explore a little bit. Yeah, and I figured we could do that around the lower edge.
I'm out of cobbles. Pretty good, though. Mm-hmm. Got a, lot, a fair bit done today. Not as much as we probably could have, but we've been making steady progress. And with six days to go until day 21, I have plenty of food for once all this stuff comes in. Yeah. And we'll have chrysanthemum tea to drink to help with the overheating issues. Goldenrod, if we need some stamina. A lot more cotton. I'll have some potatoes and blueberries. Get the upstairs finished enough. We'll have a whole bunch of corn and other stuff. Yep. Technically, I can just go over to the other house and plant some more corn if I really need. Um, and then I figure the next platform that we should be overly concerned with, since we still have a ton of trees that we can go through, is probably the uh, forge, forge bed. I have enough room that we'll be able to get a cement mixer and stuff. I'm probably going to spend most of my night in the mine. Well, if you want to go get more stone in the mine. Yeah, I was just thinking that what I'm probably going to do is head back down. Uh, see about some more stone. See about getting some more cobblestone going. Okay. But then again, the sooner that we get those six forges up, uh, the sooner we can uh, worry about purchasing the concrete mixer work because we do have a convenient cement mixer that we can take advantage of. That is true. To get us started, at least. Um, but we mm -hmm. will go ahead and call the episode here, so I would like to thank you all for watching, and we will see you all next time. Bye for now.